For the second time in just a span of a couple of hours, Sacramento County Sheriff's deputies are responding to a shooting in the Arden Arcade area. The second shooting not far from the first. ABC 10's Garage Paul Sanga is live tonight outside the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office. What are we learning tonight? Yeah, Luke, luckily the person who was shot is expected to survive, so that is the good news. But exactly what happened, investigators are still trying to piece that together as to what led up to this shooting. So that scene has since been cleared. We're here at the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office. But let's go and show you video of what the scene looked like just a few hours ago. That's about three and a half miles from where we are. Now, we're told that call came in around 8.30 p.m. We're told the shooting happened at Bohemian Park near Wright Street. Then the person shot walked over to a nearby neighborhood in the Church Avenue area, and that is when someone in that area took the victim to North Kaiser Hospital. Now, the sheriff's office says the man suffered from a gunshot wound in the growing region, and the police tell us that person is expected to survive. Now, we have learned multiple people assaulted the man before the shooting. Now, it is unclear exactly what led up to the situation, but here's what the sheriff's office said when asked about the rise in shootings across Sacramento County. Letting bad guys on the street with guns, you keep letting them out of jail and you keep letting them roam free. This is a byproduct of that. So, uh, no, it, yeah, it's a long weekend, but we have long weekends all the time. We have Saturdays every week. Okay, it's not a day of the week problem. It's a keeping criminals out of jail problem. Uh, bad guys are going to do bad guy stuff, and this is just par for the course. And now the one thing that we do know is that this shooting, we're told by officers, is not related to the shootings that happened today. But no suspect information or suspects information has been released regarding this shooting. But luckily, that person who was shot is expected to survive. Luke. That's the good news tonight, Garsh Paul. A violent end, though, to uh, Labor Day weekend here in Sacramento. Thank you. And we mentioned that this was the second shooting in the area. The 63 year old man who was shot earlier tonight was also hospitalized, but he too is expected to survive. It happened along Edison Avenue. Sacramento County Sheriff's deputies say that the victim and suspect were involved in an argument in a driveway when the suspect pulled a gun and shot the victim at least three times. The suspect took off. The victim was taken to the hospital where he's stable tonight. Fortunately, right now, we've got a lot of witnesses that are coming forward right now, giving us great information. They're tired of seeing this in their neighborhood. They're tired of seeing this in their community. Deputies say that shooting appears to have been an isolated incident.